All right, good afternoon, everyone. Let's bring you up to date with what's going on for the rest of the afternoon because there will be areas of light snow, blowing and drifting snow as well. Strong northwesterly winds, 15 to 25 miles per hour. Some gusts to and over 40. And the snow has really piled up for areas to the north and east. Locally, it's not going to be that much, 30 to 35. And there will be areas of light snow and snow showers through the overnight. Still windy and cold, and especially that open Farm country blowing and drifting a big problem with a low of 26. Let's bring you up to date with what's going on with the latest advisories. As of uh, about noontime, lake snow warnings continue in the dark green and then the bay shaded counties over the northern tier for Tioga and Bradford County in northern Pennsylvania. Wind advisory also uh, Shimung County in the wind advisory, but up here is where all the snow is occurring and will be through the afternoon. So there's a look at live Doppler radar right now. Uh, we put the loop on it and notice again, it's off to the north and east. That's where the steadiest of the snow has been. There's been some enhancement, uh, some darker colors here on the radar algorithm indicating where the steadiest of the snow is. And with time, this area of snow up here will start to back its way and kind of pivot its way to the south. So as we head into this evening, a round of snow. It's been zip code snow for sure. Check these accumulations out or total so far as of about noontime Elmira a measly inch. You're watching this going what on earth is he talking about? Watkins Glen at six inches. Ithaca has seven. Trumansburg just outside of Ithaca up to eight inches. Look at Spencer at 13 inches. Mecklenburg between Watkins Glen and Ithaca along Route 79 has 15 inches of snow on the ground. And as of this update, Newark Valley in northern Tioga County in the southern tier, 21 inches of snow. So here's what we're expecting in terms of snowfall totals by Tuesday morning. Notice locally it's just this one to two inch deal. But notice how I mean, we're it's just right there. I mean, you go to two to four. Bath, northern sections of Steuben County, extreme northeastern, uh, northeastern Shimung County, four to nine in this darker blue, much of Schuyler County, Watkins Glen. Uh, and then you get into the red, that's nine to 15 inches with locally higher amounts anywhere in these red swatches that you see here. Uh, already over two feet of snow, as I mentioned in Newark Valley. So there will be localized higher amounts but anywhere you see the red there on the map, that's 9 to 15 inches. I mentioned that band of snow off to the north and east. Watch tonight. Okay, here we are, 9, 10 o'clock. Notice how it's starting to settle and kind of pivot its way to the south. So we'll put the map into motion, see how it kind of hangs out here and then kind of sinks south a little bit. So as we head towards this evening, notice uh, some of that snow tends to back in a little bit with some additional accumulations. But again, by far and away, north and east. That's where the jackpot totals will be. Flurries and snow showers linger on Tuesday, 36. Clouding up Wednesday, better day for travel, 40. There may be a little bit of a wintry mix at night. And then for Thanksgiving, a little bit of a wintry mix changing to light rain, a high of 42. Some light rain Friday, 45, and maybe a bit of flurries or light rain Saturday, 41. Partly sunny Sunday, 42. Updates all afternoon on air and online. Have a good day.